Welcome back to Rewind with B. Schwitty because, oh fuck, I don't have this ready. Welcome back to Rewind with the Schwitty because there's something so human about taking something and ruining it a little so you can have more of it. Today is National Frozen Yogurt Day. And while we thought frozen yogurt was dying out, it has a national day for it. So I figured we'd roll back into the usual groove and uh, try to pair some wine with it. Um, I'm going to be trying to pair this late harvest Savion Blanc from Bishop's Peak. And uh, I have three contestants here. The first one is a beautiful... Strawberry cheesecake froyo with some random toppings. Uh, second one is a dark chocolate froyo with more random toppings. And finally, a pistachio froyo for uh, for fun, for funsies. And I'm trying to hurry because I'm almost out of space on both memory cards right now. And I just wanna shoot this. Alright, let's start with pairing number one, shall we? I'm gonna go Froyo first, no accoutrement. This is half cheesecake, half strawberry. Remember, we're gonna sip first, then taste, then sip. That one turned it a little sour. Um, the late Harvest Savion Blanc isn't sweet enough to combat the uh, frozen yogurt in this case not not the best combo at the moment let's uh, move on to number two now this is the super dark chocolate does actually work better somehow the chocolate the dark chocolate bitterness kind of uh, takes away a little of that sweetness that um, this late harvest Sauvignon Blanc has it's a 2012 from Edna Valley now let's see the pistachio So currently, this pairs best with the pistachio frozen yogurt. There was like a little caramely eruption that came out of this, which may have something to do with the zebra popcorn that's on top of it. But uh, I'm going to say that out of the three, the most balanced pairing currently by itself is the pistachio. All right, we're going to move ahead and we're going to try the random toppings that I picked out. Uh, for each one and see how well it does. Uh, for the strawberry cheesecake, I have mochi, uh, fruity pebbles, uh, Reese's Pieces, and uh, a macaroon. flavor combination in the froyo itself and then followed up with this wow no absolutely not try the second one uh, I have brownie bits uh, what appears to be ah peanut butter cups might be Snickers a little biscotti and Captain Crunch 
All right, let's give it a whirl. this one <laughs> wow with that little hint of Reese's peanut butter cup in here and the dark chocolate this becomes a peanut butter jelly sandwich in your mouth but right at the end it starts out pretty bad uh, that tartness from the dark chocolate is definitely this is better than the first one not better than pistachio by itself. Finally, we're going to finish with the pistachio. I put zebra popcorn, cheesecake bits, and a maraschino cherry in with this. I thought that would be a good mix. Let's see how it pairs. Not as good without or with the extra toppings. Um, so, just to recap, uh, number two with the brownies and the chocolate and the Captain Crunch and the Reese's Pieces or the uh, Reese's Peanut Butter Cups takes the the victor for pairing um, with a late harvest Savion Blanc. So. Uh, if you're going to get toppings on your frozen yogurt, go with the Sauvignon Blanc. Um, if you're just going to get plain, plain frozen yogurt to pair with this uh, late harvest Sauvignon Blanc, go with a plain pistachio. And uh, did we learn something here today? No. But I got to eat a bunch of frozen yogurt. Computer, stop timer. 12 minutes timer canceled. And I got to drink a light cover of Sauvignon Blanc that's been sitting on my shelf for quite some time. <sighs> Happy National Frozen Yogurt Day, everyone. And shout out to uh, Yogurtland for, uh, well, not hooking me up, but having frozen yogurt available because it's the last place to buy frozen yogurt in this town. Anyway... Thank you for watching today. Please stay tuned Friday. We're going to be doing a vlog at Seven Angel Cellars Tasting Room for their grand opening weekend, uh, which was quite fun. Uh, I hope you join me for that. Either way, please share, comment, like, and subscribe. What are you going to do today on National Yogurt Day? Are you going to do a crazy wine pairing of your own? Let me know. I'd like to know. What's your favorite yogurt, frozen yogurt flavor and toppings? And... How gross were these? Thank you for watching. My name is B. Schwitty, this has been Rewind, and I will catch you 